welcome back to Sailing Blue Moon. We've been living and working in Darwin for the past two years. This chapter in our lives is drawing to a close, and Indonesia is calling our names. Now that the boat is back in the water and in a safe marina, we can get those little jobs done. And to try and fit everything into one video is almost impossible. We sanded and painted the new saloon couches ourselves, and even upholstered the cushions too. Whilst installing the new flooring, Dylan cut his bloody hand open. What do you think of my hand, Lauren? Um. It's actually six stitches. Wait, oh, is it? One, two, three. Yeah, six stitches. Pretty impressive, eh? Mm. The paint on the couches are finally finished and the cushions. Lauren's done an awesome job on the cushions. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty excited. Tonight's the first night we actually have slept, like we're going to sleep here. Look at these on board. Hiding in the room. I see you, Pippi. So see you, Pippi. Uh, rain two days ago and well, a lot of the hatches <laughs> a lot of the hatches need to be resealed but that's all right that's what we're doing right now Loz is onto it Lauren's taped all around here. Now I'm going to get the silicon gun. This is a very temporary fix, so don't don't be hating. Don't be hating. But I'm going to go around with the silicon gun, filling in the gaps. I'm going to peel the tape off, and then it'll be a nice straight bead of silicon. Time to peel the tape off. <laughs> Bay, Fanny Bay. First time solo. First time solo or duo. And yeah, we nailed it so far though. Who knows, we might run around somewhere along the way. So. We are there. We're coming around through there between the sandbar and Cullen Bay. And then we're going to anchor up in Fanny Bay. Anchor up for the night into maybe the yacht club or something, have a beer and, and have some dinner on the boat. And tomorrow we're going to beach it and uh, scrape the props and just check out all the barnacles on the hull, see if, see if there's a heap of growth. I don't think there'll be much, but I really need to about it. Put the anodes on? Three or four months ago. Oh, and we had to put shaft anodes on, but we've been putting that off for a while, so yeah. Good little outing. It's relaxing, so nice. Also, before we came out here, we did a heap of jobs, a heap of jobs uh, with the anchor. Uh, our anchor winch failed, the windlass, so we have to try and repair that, get a new one, um, replace the exhaust elbow, mixing elbow for the one of the engines, and fix the fuel leak on the starboard side engine. Uh, we had the uh, Janola repaired and uh, we've got that put back on, we put it up earlier. It just wasn't enough, enough wind to actually move us along so maybe tomorrow we'll go out when it, in the morning, it gets a bit windier in the morning, there's a turtle. I just saw a turtle, popped its head up. Definitely a turtle. That, folks, is why you don't drop your cigarette butts in the ocean. Your cigarette butts are evil and they kill all the turtles. So 
I'm quite the fishing professional. And what I've got here is a really shitty plastic. It's broken. And then I've got a big chunk of chicken because that's all the meat we had as a bait. Because uh, I baited my, not bait, no, I, what is it? When the, when the hook comes oh, you snagged? Snag. Snag. Do you think that's what Americans call it? Snagged? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> what are like snagged? Is that even, a, is that? Yeah, you got snagged on the rocks. Anyway, and now what you want to do is you want to, you want to cast real good. Probably all of the chicken flew off. Then you want to be patient. Do not much at all and just hope that something else bites it. And she's on! Nah, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you were like, it's happening. Yeah, I thought she, she's, she's, she's done well. Uh, I've been out done again. <laughs> and uh, yeah, obviously Lauren just said she snagged that rod, so we only bought one hook. It was only a quick last minute mission. This is my new $39 fishing rod. Yeah, 39 bucks just for... What's a stainless steel ma main shaft? And it's made of the finest quality shitty plastic. Do you have a cardo? <laughs> <laughs> is that what you're thinking about when you're cutting? <laughs> Do you drive over? But did you drive over? Oi, but I'm really tired, mate. It's because I didn't have a coffee. Yeah, good job. No coffee is full of. Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> Join us next time as we rename the boat, provision and make passage to Kupang.